I'm David DeSerto with my Real Fate 60 Second Review of The Wolf of Wall Street, director Martin Scorsese's provocative adaptation of Jordan Belfort's autobiography, charting his rise and fall as a stockbroker who built a financial empire on fraud in the 1990s. Leonardo DiCaprio gives a committed performance, and Scorsese's cinematic pizzazz is in full force. But almost from the opening image, viewers are bombarded by a three-hour assault of nonstop obscenities, gratuitous graphic sexuality, and drug content. In critiquing decadent excess, the film is guilty of excess. Less is sometimes more. In this case, a lot less. Equally objectionable, the overall moral neutrality. I certainly don't think Scorsese is trying to celebrate greed or say it's good, but he's not saying it's bad. He just puts it out there and lets viewers decide. My opinion? Don't invest. Somewhere in this hedonistic fever dream, there's a message about what Pope Francis calls the idolatry of money and gaining the world but losing your soul. But its near pornographic shock value cancels any real dividends.